guys, it's Kay from Habneet Home. Happy Friday to you. Um, I had another video which I was planning to upload today, which was a vlog from yesterday. It's a different kind of video. It's not a cleaning video. It's not a uh, organizing video. It's just a vlog. Um, in light of this week's events, I felt a need to put a more, a, a much more positive and motivating message on to the world right now so i hope you guys enjoy this message instead and i will upload the vlog tomorrow i know this is a home organizing and cleaning channel um, but i'd like to delve a little deeper today so why organize i organize houses for a living and i love it i think it's great i live in a really organized place and everything is neat and i can find things uh, about 99.99 percent .99 of the time I'm not perfect. Every now and again, I do misplace something, but it's very rare, actually. Um, but why? Why be an organized person? Why bother to actually take the time to organize your house, your purse, your things, your workplace, your desk, whatever? Why do that? Why does it, why does it matter? Well, it matters for a few reasons. So, A, uh, it may bother you that your space is disorganized. If it does, uh, it can relieve a lot of stress and anxiety by you know getting to a point where you can actually function and that is really my message uh, it, it is have to have function not to have you know completely perfect Pinteresty spaces even though that it's nice and looks really aesthetically pleasing if that Pinteresty space doesn't uh, function for you then you've lost the point of organizing altogether uh, another reason is that uh, there was a recent study, it was done a few years ago, I think, and uh, it uh, is only, I think it uh, only has to do with the United States, but it uh, came to the conclusion that Americans spend 55 minutes a day looking for items. 55 minutes a day, that is almost 12 days per year, 12 full days looking for things. In the world today, there is an infinite amount of love, and also it seems like an infinite amount of hate, and an infinite amount of smiles, and an infinite amount of pain. But you know, there's one thing that there's definitely not an infinite amount of, and it's time. In 55 minutes, you could go and commute and see a friend you haven't seen in two weeks, and spend time with them. In 55 minutes, you could take your dog on a well-deserved walk that he wanted all day. In 55 minutes, you could get outside with your daughter and finally teach her how to ride that bike. In 55 minutes, you could make banana bread and bring it to your neighbor. In 55 minutes, you could finally fix that button that fell off of your sweater. In 55 minutes, you could wander around your neighborhood and look at all of the beautiful homes. In 55 minutes, you could study a little bit for that midterm that's next Friday that you're stressed out about. In 55 minutes, you could finally start writing that novel that you've been threatening to write for the last five years. In 55 minutes, you could probably weed your whole garden. In 55 minutes, you could probably fold the laundry. In 55 minutes, you could call your dad and tell him you love him. In 55 minutes, you could probably make a YouTube video if you've been meaning to start that. In 55 minutes, you could live more instead of just looking for something. I want to encourage you to start small if you've been meaning to get organized, and I want to encourage you to do it now. Not tomorrow, not next week, but do it now. All the time spent planning and hoping and wishing, it's not guaranteed to us. Live for now. Live for today. Enjoy your life today. If you start today and your environment is neat and doesn't cause you as much anxiety as it has before, then you have enriched your life tenfold. You don't have to do it all at once. You can start with one drawer, one section of the drawer, one closet, one room, then it turns into one side of the house, then it turns into the whole house, and then you can't be stopped. If you're overwhelmed, get someone to help you. Get a friend, get a relative, hire a professional organizer, just get some help. And with that, I'd like to announce that I have created a Facebook group 
for this YouTube channel called Honey Home Community. It's under the name HNH Community. I will link the Facebook group down below. Right now it is a private group, so I must approve you in order to be added to the group, but it's a place to share your before and after photos of your organizing and cleaning projects, and just to get general support and to ask questions and uh, be sort of cheerleaders for each other. I will be introducing a series on the channel called Fall Into Place. It's about organizing and getting your home and your life ready for fall because it's just around the corner. And uh, if I love one thing about living in New England, it is fall. It is the most beautiful season to live in New England. And I cannot wait. I cannot wait for fall. But there are some things that you must do to get your home and your life ready for fall. And I cannot wait for you guys to uh, see these videos. I will post the first one next Monday. And I hope that you will join on the Fall Into Place project. It'll be like a group thing, really fun. And uh, hope you join the Facebook page and join us there. I just wanna give a really short, sweet little plug to my friend who has created a really awesome cookie company called The Cookie Cafe. Here is my box of cookies that I received in the mail. I will leave a link to their website down below. They make excellent, excellent cookies, and I will show you how they are packaged. Is this not so cute? I mean, they came to me yesterday and they are delicious. So if you know somebody who's having a really bad day or if they're not feeling well or if they're going through a hard time, please send them some cookies. It will make them feel better. Send them snickerdoodles because they're the best. And uh, I will link the Cookie Cafe down below. They are, uh, I'm, this is not sponsored. I'm not getting any like kickbacks from if you order cookies or not. These are dear friends of mine who I have known since middle school and I want to help them out. This is their beautiful first business and uh, I love cookies, so yeah. So I hope this video was helpful in some kind of way or motivating in some kind of way. I feel like I was all over the place and all that stuff, but in general, save time, do it now. Join the Facebook group if you'd like. We've got the Fall Into Place series coming. Get some cookies and um, be kind to one another. I don't know if you can read my shirt, but it says, Support the friendship party. Please support the friendship party. We don't have an infinite amount of time. Be kind to one another. Tell the people in your life you love them. Tell them now. Do the things to change your life now. I'll see you guys on Monday. Actually, I'm gonna see you guys probably tomorrow. But I'll officially see you guys again on Monday. All right, you guys, have a great weekend and uh, Stay neat. Keep it that way. Up among the stars, we'll find a harmony of life to a love.